Let me be the first to say welcome back to January. It is a one day blast of Arctic air, but of course the roads aren't great. So with the roads tonight, we send things out to my colleague Rose Schmidt out in our weather tracker tonight. Rose, where are you? How are the roads? Well, I would say, Ian, the side streets are slick. So are those sidewalks, but we are on 169 going south right now. And let's show you what we're seeing. I would say that there are parts of the road definitely covered in snow, but we're not seeing as many slick spots on these main roads. But MnDOT does say keep an eye on slick spots tonight and especially tomorrow morning for the commute because that could give you some trouble spots. There's only two options these days. You love the winter. I'm enjoying it as much as I can. Or I'm over it. You don't. I am like fed up with the snow. I'm like done with it. I'm ready for warmer weather. Some of us wishing for sunshine and sandals, but Minnesota refusing to deliver. It's dragging on and I feel like we've had more storms and like a lot more snow piling up like the potholes are terrible too. And speaking of roads, Thursday afternoon brought the occasional slick spot in the metro. They didn't look too bad. I mean, it's just wet right now, but I'm assuming it's probably going to get a little worse as it keeps on putting this down. So MnDOT says treating the roads doesn't do much when they're really wet. But the good news, when it's above 15 degrees, their materials work well. The real challenge will be the wind keeping it cold out there, potentially blowing back some snow, and certainly just those colder road temp areas, ramps, bridges, overpasses. Those are your trouble spots, so definitely watch out for those. We're already among the state's top 10 snowiest winters, so if more of this doesn't excite you... My stomach turns. <laughs> I don't feel good. You're not alone, but take it from the hardiest Minnesotans... Hey, I'm a hockey coach. Uh, bring it on. It's all right. Winter is not over, but we've got this. Oh, not a problem. If you can't handle this, you shouldn't live here. We are really starting to hear the wind now. I don't know if you could hear that through our weather car, but we're hearing it. And it's starting to kind of shake the car just a tiny bit. So keep an eye on the roads tonight and tomorrow. And by the way, speaking of tomorrow, my friend Ian wanted to remind you all that tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day. And back in 2012, St. Patrick's Day was 79 degrees. So I think we're wishing it was like that. The people we talked to definitely are as well. We'll send it back to you in studio. Oh, don't remind us, Rose. Don't remind us. All right, thanks. New